In each one of our lightboard packages, we supply a number of fluorescent ink dry erase markers for use on the board. Some of them are ready right out of the box, like the Expo Neons. I can take these as soon as they're out of the box, make markings, and they're ready to go. But if you want to use other brands, for example, Quartet, you have to prime them first. Here's how to do that. Take the cap off, and you'll notice that it is dry and not the color of the ink. It's kind of a yellow color, and if I try and draw with it, nothing is going to come out. So to prime it, give it a few good shakes. There we go and then pump it onto a surface. Now you can do this onto a towel, you can do this onto a piece of scrap paper. I'm gonna do it right on the board to show you what I'm doing here. So taking the tip, I'm gonna press in hard and do a number of hard presses to get the ink flowing. Now this does take 10, 20, 30 seconds to start getting ink to flow. Give it a couple good shakes in between. I'll keep pumping on that, holding it down. There we go, I'm starting to get a little bit of ink going. Perfect, a couple more shakes. And now you'll begin to see here in just a moment, I'm gonna start making some markings here on the board. There we go. A couple more. Shake it one last time. There we go. And now our markers are good and primed and ready to go. So if you wanna extend the life of these, which I encourage, every time that you are done using the marker, go ahead and put the cap on firmly, of course. Store them horizontally or facing down. If you have them facing up, that tip is going to dry out and it's not going to saturate the tip. So it could really dull the life of your marker. And of course, we do not want that. So store them correctly, use them liberally, and I hope that you have an excellent time with your new lightboard.